Suspect uses AI face swap technology to defraud Fujian boss scammed out of 4.3 million yuan in 10 minutes. Several AI face swap related cases have been reported in mainland China in recent years. As AI technology develops rapidly in recent years, more and more criminals are beginning to exploit it for nefarious purposes. Recently, an AI face swap scam took place in Fuzhou, Fujian province, where a tech company boss was defrauded of 4.3 million yuan RMB, in just 10 minutes. The Cyber Crime Investigation Bureau of the Baudo Public Security Bureau in Inner Mongolia has released this case. At about 11.40 on April 20th, Mr. Gua, the legal representative of a technology company in Fuzhou, received a sudden video call on WeChat from a friend who told Mr. Gua that his friend was bidding for a project in another city and needed a 4.3 million yuan deposit. The friend wanted to use Mr. Gua's company account for the transaction. The friend asked Mr. Gua for his bank card number, claiming that he had already transferred the money to Mr. Gua's account and sent a screenshot of the bank transfer receipt to Mr. Gua via WeChat. Based on trust and identity verification through video, Mr. Gua transferred 4.3 million yuan in two installments to his friend's bank card at 11.49 without checking whether the money had arrived. With the help of the bank, the Cyber Crime Investigation Bureau of Baudo Public Security Bureau successfully intercepted 3.3684 million yuan of the defrauded funds in the scam account. After the transfer, Mr. Gua sent a message to this friend via WeChat saying that the matter was taken care of, but his friend was completely unaware of it. Only then did Mr. Gua realize he had been scammed. The scammer had used AI face swap and voice imitation technology to impersonate his friend and carry out the fraud. It's noteworthy that the scammer didn't add Mr. Gua as a friend using a simulated WeChat account of the friend, but initiated a video chat directly through the friend's WeChat. This is one of the reasons Mr. Guo was scammed. The scammer likely used technical means to steal Mr. Guo's friend's WeChat. Subsequently, at 12.21 on the same day, the Cyber Crime Investigation Bureau of Baudo City received a request for assistance from the Criminal Investigation Brigade of Fuzhou City Public Security Bureau in Fujian Province. The bureau acted immediately and, with the full cooperation of the bank, successfully intercepted 3.3684 million yuan of defrauded funds in the scam account within just 10 minutes. However, 931,600 yuan of the funds had been transferred, and Fujian and Baudo police are currently working hard to recover it. Several similar cases have been reported in mainland China in recent years. As reported by mainland media, in February 2022, a Mr. Chen reported to the Ohai Sub-Bureau Xianyan Police Station in Wanzhou, Zhejiang Province, that he had been defrauded of nearly 50,000 yuan by a friend. The police confirmed that the fraudsters had used AI technology to synthesize a face swap using video footage of one of Mr. Chen's friends posted on a social platform. This created the illusion of a video chat with the friend to gain Mr. Chen's trust and thus carry out the scam. The mainland police remind the public to be vigilant against AI fraud. Don't easily provide personal biological information such as faces and fingerprints to others, and don't overly publish or share animated images or short videos. Verify the identity of the other party through multiple communication channels such as phone calls before making online transfers. If you detect any risks, report them and seek help in time. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into Chinese cultures.